sometimes it is not going to be easy to get there. In fact, most times it's not going to be easy to get there. But don't let the work deter you from going for what it is that you want to do. When you realize what your thing is, or maybe you have more than one thing, it's something that you'll be drawn to naturally because it is something that you're good at. It's something that will fulfill you and make you feel great about yourself. And nine times out of 10, that gift that you have will likely be something that you can pour into others. There's gonna be times when things are just not great. We have good times, we have bad times. Right. During those trying times, we tend to forget that we still have a job to do. We still have to keep going. We still have to stay the course. You know, the Bible tells us that faith without work is dead. Don't give up. Don't feel like because you're not there yet, it's your sign that it's not meant to be. Honestly, good things come to those who put in the work. You will see some sort of success eventually, but you can't just wait. You can't just sit on this gift and not practice it, not work at whatever it is you need to do to fine tune it, not do the research, not put in the hours of dedication to fine tuning that skill and think that that gift is just gonna be blossomed and grow upon you. If you stop using that gift, you can lose it. Think about people who learn a second language. <laughs> I'm guilty. You learn that second language, but if you stop using it, you will forget the second language that you've learned. You may be able to pick up little bits and pieces if you're placed in an environment where you have no choice, but you're not gonna be as sharp on that skill if you don't practice. And the same thing applies to anything you wanna do. You can't just expect it to be overnight success. And a lot of times when we hear about the success stories, you don't get the headline of all the no's that that person received, all of the challenges that that person received, because that's not glamorous. And that's not what people want to sell you when they're trying to get you to sign up for their cryptocurrency, um, life coach, wellness coach journey to meet their quota, okay? They're not gonna give you those stories. They're gonna tell you about how they woke up making six figures. They're gonna tell you about the greatest parts of the story because that's what looks good and that's what's going to attract people to want to get there. But the truth of the matter is most people get to where they are with some form of work and it's not always going to be handed to you. It's not always going to be at the opportune time. It's not always going to be when things are perfectly planned and in order in your life. Sometimes you have to work despite of the divorce, despite of the things going on with your kids, despite of the loss of friends, despite of the loss of family, despite of the loss of resources, you gotta still keep going and keep doing and keep showing up and showing out when it's just you, party of one, okay? This is your sign to keep going for your dream or your dreams. Sometimes we have more than one gift that God has blessed us with. And so don't lose sight of that because of the challenges. Don't let the work part of that goal deter you from getting to where you're supposed to be. Because I believe that you can do all things in Christ that strengthens you. That is something my mom used to tell me and I live with that and I carry it on my back. It's not to say that I don't get discouraged sometimes or get frustrated because I'm human and you are too. But don't stay there. Keep working at it, keep grinding, and it will be yours. The first step is believing that you can do it. The next step is working to get there. Once you get there, you will feel that accomplishment. You will understand that every single no was for a reason to build that character and get you ready for what you asked for. So use this as a sign to keep moving. And if this video motivated you, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Share it with somebody else who needed to hear it too. One of my goals right now is to get to 20K on this channel. So hit that subscribe button and help me grow. And come up, be a part of this community too. You're gonna love it here. By the way, I'm Yosha, your go-to girl for all things real. So if you like this video, maybe you wanna hear a little more real talk, definitely subscribe and stick around because I have more of it coming. All right, bye y'all. Have a great day.